what's going on guys Android Extremis here from AndroidExtremis.com in this video I'm going to show you how to install Android 4.3 on your Nexus 4 this is uh, DODX zip file which is a uh, stock ROM if you want to place it that way but uh, you need to have custom recovery installed with rooted phone so if you don't have that go ahead and uh, check the description for a full video on how to root your Nexus 4 so once you do that go ahead and boot into your TWRP or CWM recovery if you don't know how to do that go ahead and turn off the phone press all three buttons volume up volume down and power button until the first vibrate let go the power button and you'll be presented in the uh, bootloader menu and from there press the volume key down twice and you will be it will say a recovery mode and press power button then you can boot into your custom recovery once you're right here we're going to go ahead and wipe so make sure you back up everything before wiping and once after you wiped we're going to go to install and navigate to the file it says mac macro 4.3 rooted your x sign zip file so right here is what you are installing and that's the log right here and right there is the process bar with the name of the file that you're flashing now depending on speed of your phone I think it's Nexus 4 all of them are same but this is the newest software we are flashing and that's why it will take about a minute and a half to two minutes because this new system needs to settle down and all the files and everything needs to be placed so it's gonna take quite a while compared to your source ROM flashing and all that so make sure you give it good time before it finishes the process after your phone finishes the process once you reboot, we are going to wipe the every cache and then reboot our phone. Go back, reboot system. And now it's going to be rebooting your phone. Make sure you give it like two or three minutes for the system to settle down before you start messing with your newest Android version of 4.3 Nexus 4. So please go ahead and let it sit for two or three minutes after the phone boots up so the new system can settle down. Now I'm going to be up until the phone boots up on the home screen and uh, I'll be doing a, a full review of this 4.3. There are a lot of features that you might want to check out in the review and uh, decide yourself if you want to flash this over your very own Cyanogemar 10.1 or AOKP which or you, one you're running. So as I said before, this will take quite a while because the new system, new files, which needs to settle down. So we are patiently going to wait here until this setup process finishes. Again, don't freak out if it's taking too long because this is the leaked version of the newest Android system. I've been, I've been, keep saying it for past, I don't know, couple of minutes that it will take time to boot up. Right there is your phone just booted up in your newest OS 4.3. So thumbs up is always appreciated for videos like this because this is very exciting because you just got newest Android on your Nexus 4 and uh, subscribe for the full review of 4.3. Thank you for watching guys and I will see you in the next video.